Treehouse of Horror 14 is pretty awesome. One of the three stories I didn't love, but there were still bits of it that I quite liked. This is the first episode of the 15th season of The Simpsons, directed by Jim Reardon and Stephen Dean Moore. And as always, I will go through each of the segments and give some spoiler-free thoughts. If there's anything that I come up with that I want to mention that's a spoiler, I'll save it for the end. But I don't think there will be. But I, it, I love how it started. They're dressed as Peanuts characters. Bart is dressed as Charlie Brown. Lucy, uh, Lisa is dressed as Lucy. And it's just fabulous. As a Charlie Brown fan, I absolutely love that. And then the main narratives kick in. And the first one we have is uh, Reaper Madness, where Homer has to take the place of the Grim Reaper. And I wasn't entirely sure what direction that would take or what Homer would have to do. But I think it played out pretty well. And I quite in in enjoyed it. And... Uh, I had a lot of fun with it. It was it was pretty interesting. I won't say any more than that about it, but I did I did like it. I thought the concept was pretty interesting and yeah, ultimately what happened with that I didn't see coming. So it it, it was quite surprising and I quite liked it. The second one I didn't really care for and that's Frankenstein. And I think the main reason I don't like it is because I this might be an unpopular opinion, but I don't really like Dr. or Professor Frank. I'm not really a fan of the character, but it turns out that he's kept his father's corpse frozen after his father was in a pretty horrendous accident, and he brings his father back to life, obviously Frankenstein, Frankenstein, and, well, his father ends up reconstructing his own body out of bits of different Simpsons characters, and that's the bit I liked, seeing him being made from, you know, the hair of this character and the legs of this character, and just visually it looked awesome to see him being an amalgamation of these different characters and it was a lot of fun and I really liked that bit but the rest of it yeah I didn't really care too much for and the third one I think is my favorite of the three stop the world I want to goof off and in this one Bart and Milhouse have this stopwatch that can stop time and of course they have a lot of fun with this and play a lot of jokes on people but things get out of hand and go in a direction they weren't expecting and I won't say any more than that but I had a lot of fun with it. They could have done so many different things, but I think what they did was the right decision. And what happened at the end, the last kind of minute or two, was so fun. So well animated. Beautifully animated episode. Visually so engaging. Really entertaining. A great way to end Treehouse of Horror 14. That's a ridiculous amount. And yeah, if I were to rank them, I'd have to go Stop the World I Want to Goof Off, Reaper Madness, and then Frankenstein. But none of them were bad. Frankenstein wasn't terrible. I didn't love it, but I didn't mind watching it. But certainly the other two I actually thought were uh, were pretty great. And uh, season season 15 is off to a pretty glorious start. <laughs>